Along the San Diego County coastline, SeaWorld San Diego's rescue team has rescued 24 sea lions and 8 seabirds showing symptoms of domoic acid poisoning. Nine of the sea lions have died. It seems that there are more animals that need our help, uh, more than last year um, and more than the year before. Jenny Smith is curator of the rescue program at SeaWorld San Diego. She says domoic acid is a naturally occurring neurotoxin produced by certain harmful algal blooms. Uh, the algae bloom is called Pseudonychia. The fish eat the algae and then the sea lions eat the fish and it causes the sea lions to have seizures. It affects their brain. It affects their heart. Clarissa Anderson is the director of the Southern California Coastal Ocean Observing System at Scripps Institution of Oceanography. It wasn't until just this last week that we started to see measurements or get measurements, hits of toxin measurements at Scripps Pier and other places in San Diego. Smith says SeaWorld has received an influx of calls in the past week about distressed sea animals. We kind of look like they're uh, stargazing. I've heard that the sea lion looks drunk. <laughs> I've heard so many different things. They can be abnormally aggressive. They can look just totally out of it because uh, the toxins. Anderson says this year's algal bloom is slightly different from previous ones. We've seen domoic acid in the water this early in the year before. It's not that unusual. Um, having all these animals come in this time of year is unusual. Um, and it looks to me like it's connected a bit to La Nina. We're having an early onset upwelling, which is what fuels these blooms. Smith says SeaWorld has brought in additional staff to help care for the affected animals. The best treatment for all of these animals is to provide them with lots of fluids and try to flush out that toxin. So that's kind of the first step after we rescue them, we assess them. SeaWorld confirmed they also received calls about two common dolphins. One went back into the ocean and the other died during transport. Meanwhile, Smith introduces us to three adult female sea lions who are responding well to treatment. She expects they will eventually be released. If you see a marine animal that may have domoic acid poisoning, SeaWorld recommends staying at least 50 feet away and calling 1-800-541-7325 providing the location, size of the animal, symptoms, and behavior can be helpful. Melissa May, KPBS News.